hello everyone in this video i'm going to show you how you can access your virtual machine using a vnc so if you click on your virtual machine you will see an option here no vnc no vnc itself is a vnc that means you do not have to install separate one on your system proxmox already come with no vnc what we have to do is we have to assign a port to it so we can access it using our proxmox ip address that's what we are going to use not our virtual machines ip address so first we have to look at the documentation if you search vnc proxmox then click on the first one here you can see the configuration this is the folder where you will find all of your virtual machines config files so we first we have to copy this you have to click on pve1 then click on shell and here we will see d and control shift v and if i write ls i can see all of the config file for my virtual machine so 100 is for first one 101 is for second one 102 is for third one so third one is the one that i'm going to assign the ip uh, sorry the port number so i have to copy this command here and here you can see the 70 77 77 is the port you can change it to anyone i'm using two of them already so let me show you uh, this is the proxmox uh, ip and then uh, 77 is the port which is already running and then 78 what i'm going to assign port number is 79 so what i'm going to do is i'm going to click here on the shell cd again and ls uh, then I'm going to do nano102.conf then at the end I'm going to add this line control shift V and going to change the port number to 79 control X and Y this uh, step is very important you have to assign the this password but if I assign it right away it says here that you have to go to uh, the monitor section of your virtual machine so click on the virtual machine go to monitor if i assign it right now click enter then it says could not set on password because we have to restart our virtual machine so it can configure our last config change which port we have assigned and uh, what password we are going to set so what you have to do now do not restart it from inside your virtual machine uh, like click here and shut down no so now what we have to do we have to force shut it down so i'm going to click here yes and shut down so let it completely shut down then now we have to start it we're going to start it let it completely turn on so after the reboot process is complete we are going into the monitor section then we are going to copy this remember there is a white space in the back in the back so you don't have to copy that so i'm going to copy it and paste it here this foobar one is the password you can change it to whatever you like i'm going to keep the same so i'm going to enter so now you can see there is no error here so that means our password is set so how can we access it now we are going to open any vnc viewer you can use tight vnc or uh, rail vnc i'm going to use vnc viewer so now i have to copy and paste this here at the ip address of proxmox then colon then 79 port that we said enter yes uh, don't warn me again continue and then we are going to write the password that we chose which was foo bar one and remember password okay now we are inside our virtual machine let me show you something if you click on console we are live in our system now if we change here like if i type password then it will change in the both of them at the real time you can port forward it and access it through your internet the main problem you will face is how you restart it if you restart it wrong i recommend you to shut it down so first if you restart it from here sometimes it doesn't have work so what you have to do is shut down completely then uh, start with this button over here then it should work then you have to set password later after you restart and then you can access it using any vnc viewer so thank you guys for watching have a nice one